Hey, it's Kate from Dapper Exotics, and today we are getting an OBT, aka Orange Baboon Tarantula, aka Orange Bitey Thing, which is perfect because I too am an orange bitey thing. So I'm thinking I want to cover the background in flowers, so I have these fake wisteria flowers that I'm just going to cut up and glue to the base of the enclosure. So this is what I finished with. I think uh, it'll look better with everything in it. I didn't want to block these ventilation holes, otherwise I would have covered the whole thing. Um, so I went in kind of an arch. I was going to go down the middle too, but as you can see I changed my mind. Um, I think it looks better as an arch. Little oopsie right here, you can kind of see where the hot glue was, but that's okay. So now it's dirt filling time. I'm just going to use some Eco Earth. <laughs> bark and this little uh, half log, but I think we're going to utilize the half log just because I think it'll look a little bit nicer. So we are going to bury around it. Put some soap straight over here. I don't think I've mentioned, but the OBT's name is actually Smaug, so I got a little dragon skull for her. Put it right over there. Perfect. So I also got some nice challa wood. I think I'll put it right there. And I got these silk plants that I chopped up. Let's figure out where those are gonna go. I also picked up this moss that I think I am going to scatter about. Make the place look a little nicer. Yeah guys, so this is the finished enclosure for our little smaug, our little OBT. I think that I am quite happy with it. Mm -hmm. 
I think it's a nice enclosure for her. And I guess we'll see how she likes it. So this is going to be... <laughs> This is gonna be interesting, because I've never dealt with an old world before. I've dealt with some bolty new worlds. Um, if you watched my first video, you saw me dealing with the NNC Gold. That was quite bolty. And I was told that this girl actually isn't too bad, and she hasn't, like, like, she isn't really moving or threat posing at all. So, hopefully, Sassy Silks was right, and this girl isn't too bad. Um, I think I know what I'm doing. I think so. So let's see. <laughs> we are going to do this inside the enclosure. until it's time to actually do it. <laughs> I'm just trying, oh, okay. too easy. That was way too easy. What the hell? <laughs> anyway guys, this has been Dapper Exotics and this has been Smaug, provided to me for free by Sassy Silks. This video is sponsored by Sassy Silks. You can find a discount code for 5% off your order in the description below. It is Dapper05. Once again, it is Dapper05. And if you enter that code into their website, you will get 5% off your order. Anyway, my Instagram is at underscore Dapper Exotics underscore. You can follow me there to see more updates on Smaug as well as my other animals. And see you next time. Alright guys, so many of you probably realized this pretty early on into the video, but me, not having much experience with old worlds, did not realize this, and obviously Sassy Silks did not realize this. 
this ain't an OBT. <laughs> Just based on the behavior, I was a little suspicious, and based on the appearance, a lot of other people were suspicious. Um, not an OBT, it isn't Sassy Silk's fault. It was their source that mislabeled and sent it to them, and they trusted their source. So we're currently working on getting this all sorted out, but I'm not upset because I still got a free tarantula that's a nice size. I did not pay a thing, so I am still very thankful to Sassy Silks for sending me this very nice tarantula. And I still recommend you check out their site for their silkworms. Their silkworms are very nice, my animals love them. And there is a discount code in my description. Once again, it is Depero5. Um, and you can get 5% off your order. We are pretty sure that this is a G Polker piece. I've contacted many of my tarantula friends and they are all pretty certain that this is a G Polker piece. If you agree with me, if you disagree with me, please let me know in the comments. I'm going to attach some nicer photos of her at the end.